What's up? It's Joe Rady from Rady's Rides, and I am at the 2019 Rolex of 24 of Daytona here in Daytona Beach, walking up and down the manufactured midway, and of course, I'm gonna stop at the BMW tent because we have the all new 2019 BMW M850i. Guess what, the eight series is back. It's been 20 years, lots of changes. One thing is gonna be underneath that hood because no longer are we using a V12 anymore. We have a V8 twin turbocharged. It's made it to an eight speed automatic transmission and it's got a body to die for. Now remember this weekend during the Rolex at 24 at Daytona here, these will be racing factory cars in the GTLM class, also some efforts in the GTD class as well. But let's go ahead and take a look at this all new M850i. I love the front end styling. It's got that traditional BMW headlights that we love, the halo lights around the headlights, very, very nicely done. You can see the massive intakes, those are functional. Love the carbon fiber that's been added to the front of this car. As we go across, you got your twin kidney grill setup. I know some people are zonking this. They feel it looks a little like butterfly-ish. I don't know. I think it's a good take on the twin kidney grill setup, and I think it takes it into the 21st century. Let me debunk a theory on this. A lot of people always believe that the BMW in insignia meant a spinning propeller. That is not real. That's an old wives' tale. That's actually the Bavarian flag colors, the blue and white Bavarian flag, German car. That's what it's all about. Love the lower front fascia with the way that they integrated the lower lip spoiler. Little bit of an air dam down here to help you scoop up that air like a big shovel and get it into that front radiators, the inner coolers. Very nicely done. Let's go ahead and go to the side of this new M850i. Check out these wheels. I love the style. I love the gloss with the brushed aluminum. There's our M badges. BMW is notorious. They will throw M badges all over the place. And here is definitely one on the wheel. And then of course your massive calipers that are gonna be able to grip those rotors and stop on a dime and give everybody change here at the event. That's how good that brake setup is gonna be. Just wonderful uh, setup with not only the tire package, the 20 inch wheel. So they're really using their technology from the racetrack, bringing in here on the street. Another nice touch that I like the way that they connect tradition is the side vents. Very attractive, the gloss black, it's not a standard shape. You know, so many companies are just going with a flat side grill. This thing is functional and I love the look at it, of it. So that's really great. Sparkling in the sun, this color is second to none. And it really works well as we go into the carbon fiber mirrors onto that carbon fiber roof. Now, some people think, oh, carbon fiber on the roof, that's just for show. No, you're losing about eight pounds of weight off the top of the car. What that is gonna do is, it's help gonna take that center of gravity and it's gonna help bring it down to help this car handle because at the end of the day, this isn't a lightweight, but it is gonna handle better because of what BMW has done, not only with weight savings, but also with what's under those fenders, front and rear, with the suspension, with the geometry. Let's continue our way back. I love the body lines, especially this lower one near the lower sill, gives it a nice aggressive look, nice classy upscale. This is something that obviously you're gonna be able to drive every single day and enjoy that BMW heritage. As we work our way back, very, very simplistic carbon fiber deck lead spoiler, and that's okay. It doesn't have to be anything uh, obnoxious that's gonna get everybody's attention. And then here's probably one of the most unique things about this particular car, the new M850i's. I love the rear end. Check out the size of these exhausts. My only zonk for the exhaust shape is they sort of look like a vacuum cleaner. Makes me want to start vacuuming around here, but they're large, and I'm sure the sound of that twin turbo V8 is going to be glorious. As we work our way across the side here, you can see just that full carbon fiber with the diffuser, BMW logo. I like the way the tail lights, especially above uh, the red, it's sort of like smoke, gives it just a nice classy look. And these are the types of things that with BMW that just put them on a different level compared to Audi and compared to some of the other manufacturers like Mercedes-Benz and whatnot. But if these are the types of cars that you like to see on Radius Rides, leave a comment in that comment section. If you have not subscribed and you're new, on your way out, hit that subscribe button. If you are a subscriber, thank you. Thank you for being on this journey. Thank you for being part of the Radius Rides family. If you haven't seen my social media, check them all out. You know what they are. If you want some merch, click that link in the description. It takes you right to Spreadshirt. Definitely got to give a huge shout out to Big Guns McGee, Tom Motioner, working the camera. First time here at Daytona for the races. So we're definitely getting him excited, breaking his cherry. But anyways, just like always, guys, I'll see you on the next ride.